Aquarius, welcome back to my channel. This is Kelly from Moon Pie Tarot. All right, Aquarius, let's take a look and see what your love messages are for the end of July. Um, so this is for Capricorn moon, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. And as always, please be mindful. Some of the messages may or may not resonate. Did I say Capricorn? If I did, sorry. I meant Aquarius. I just finished the Capricorn reading. Um, some of the messages may or may not resonate. Take what fits, leave the rest. All right, let's get into this. Also, keep your eyes peeled. So I'm going to be doing a daily collective love tarot reading for you guys. Yay! It's going to be every single day. There will be a reading for you to listen to, to see if it relates to you, if it resonates. Just a little something to keep you going um, rather than every two weeks, rather than every month. Um, it's going to be daily. So keep your eyes open. All right, let's get into this, Aquarius. Let's take a look and see what your love messages are. What's going on? Okay, hand of cards. Taking a chance, a risk, being strategic, options, not showing your hand, gambling. Okay, and you've got love here. <laughs> love playing with them cards. Some of you, maybe you're tower readers, or you, or you do something with a deck of cards. Okay self-love your passions affection attraction and oh beautiful you've got ascension some of you are starting businesses doing tower readings um or you're doing something maybe you're learning to play poker uh, you're doing something with cards but you're whatever you're doing in your life in general you're not really showing anybody you're keeping it kind of under wraps and with this ascension like you're transcending some obstacles here and this feels like in all areas of your life okay let me see definitely oh you have preparing for union Aquarius so hmm let's take a look and see what these messages are give me just one second I want to give this a really good shuffle Oops. so we had two cards two cards fell out Okay, a couple of jumpers, that's too many. Let's just start, oh, you have three cards. Okay, past position, the hanged man, current, ooh, movement, knight of wands. Oh, okay, crossing you, you've got the three of cups. Driving the reading is the four of cups. Crowning is the world. Ooh, you've got the lovers coming towards you, the magician in position of you. External to you is strength. Queen of Cups in her hopes and your wishes, Page of Pentacles and the Eight of Pentacles. All right, so you're in decision mode right now, bottom of the deck. Do you compromise or not? You're withdrawn, you might be blocking. You are not, I feel like maybe you're building in silence. You're not letting people place their things know what's going on with you, Aquarius. Ooh, okay. You've got the, the Emperor and the King of Cups. Okay, um, definitely two other people, you're specifically not cluing in into what's going on with you. Um, the Emperor, that's Aries energy, and the King of Cups, Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Okay, um, you're also might be in a place right now where you're making a decision. Okay, which one is going to be the winner <laughs> with the Six of Wands? Okay, there's some communication you might be receiving or sending. There might be an apology coming to you. You also have the King of Wands. So, you know, it's it's male or female energy. But there's... Hmm, okay. So, all right. This is what they're telling me. There's one person who comes in, shows, in, shows up as the Emperor where you're weighing options or trying to make a decision about. You've got a King of Cups that's coming in here, um, coming in with this winning energy. And then you have... A king of wands who's showing up here with some love communication or some apology aries leo sagittarius okay so the past position hanged man hmm stuck in a situation and trying to see your way out of it in the past but currently you're in movement okay right now as you're listening to this the challenge is do you date three people or do you just try to spend more time socializing with other people I feel like you have like this fire under your feet and you want to get moving okay 
um, but there's something here where you're not you're not revealing anything Aquarius you're not revealing anything you've got the world so that's crowding on you um, your mind is like I gotta get out of here your mind is like uh, I gotta close some chapter and I gotta keep it moving here but the four of cups driving you your desires it's like too many options you don't know what to do you you're not like i feel like right now you don't know what to do and that's why you have this hand of cards because you're you know it's there's a risk do you take a chance do you take some kind of a risk here i mean your love life is ascending okay um and you want to have union but you might just be kind of like well either you don't know who to choose you've got fire for <laughs> some people here you don't know who to choose or you don't know what to choose but decision will get made the lovers is coming forward and that's gemini gemini sitting here above and below um let me see what is this lovers there's a there's a decision there's going to be a union let me see maybe it's a gemini let me see what is this lovers coming up for aquarius towards the end of july or halfway through the end of july okay well there's definitely movement yeah you're gonna make a decision take action and so is somebody else this there's an energy of like travel to be with a lover to be with someone very special let me see here okay leaving someone in the dust out in the cold well you're gonna definitely take action i can tell you that um i think you're gonna try to come to a decision who are you going to go with? Who are you going to decide? It seems like you're wishing for a water sign. Looks like you might be wishing for a water sign to connect with a water sign. Let me see. Um, who's who is Aquarius going to choose? Hmm. Oh, undecided. They're saying it's a, it's like I'm shaking the magic eight ball. Um, uh, try again ask later try again they're not saying you'll know when you know um it's going to be a mutual decision two people making a choice to be together okay um hmm is aquarius married right now is aquarius married or single um well looks like married and wanting to get out of a marriage um i don't see cheating i don't see anything like that going on i just see you um charging away from a commitment that you made it doesn't have to be marriage it could just be a relationship that you've been in um your your mindset is the world travel the world or you know explore or leave something in the past okay and your advice is sitting in the position of you as the magician manifest your dreams okay take bold action here Aquarius take on the energy of fire create that magical fire there, there's a magical fire within you and you're being asked to manifest to lay your cards out on the table to create something that you really want go after what it is that you your hopes wishes and dreams right okay external to you is the strength <clears throat> let's see huh. universe is supporting your decision you have the courage this the what's external to you is the universe <clears throat> it's supporting your decision you have the strength and the courage to make this decision there's the two of swords again I don't know why you feel like you don't but you definitely or at some point in the past have seen something quite differently you had like um the world um seeing things from a different angle a new perspective even though you're you may have felt like you've been stuck in something and you but you see it's like seeing a way out of this it, it's kind of like i was like, you know, when you're stuck in traffic, you know, you, the more stuck you are and the more you're aware you're stuck and the traffic's not moving and the more frustration you get, the, the, the 
close like the more stuck you become but if you just kind of like all right let me just accept this situation right now for what it is and turn on some music and try to enjoy um the fact that i'm stuck right now and be patient things are going to change and so i feel like you opened up your mind in the past so that you wouldn't be suffering in something because of impatience or a desire to move forward i feel like you found a way to deal with something in the past but the current energy is now you're moving forward okay and i feel like your your hopes your wishes is that queen of cups male or female energy so it feels like you you want that water sign okay you want a water sign um, or someone who comes in very supportive and loving and caring male or female energy um, understanding and patient uh, that seems to be someone who appeals to your heart uh, maybe you're you've been with someone it could have been a taurus um, any sign really where a lot of restrictions and a lot of rules um, you know aquarians are not one aquarian if there's one thing that's why the aquarian is the fool card because freedom is the number one thing that aquarius must have <clears throat> and i feel like you, you there's someone that you wish to have yeah who's very supportive um it doesn't bring in conflict or drama into your life somebody might currently be doing that so the outcome here is an opportunity to build okay um let's see let me see there's uh i feel like yeah there's a page of wands i feel like you're getting like a ticket if somebody's sending you a ticket um buying you a ticket to travel or to go somewhere somebody's got plans um and they're really investing they're really putting like this thing that they're going to give to you this ticket or to travel or to travel to you or you travel to them um they're working very hard to make sh to see that through to make sure that that happens okay this might have something to do with children or there's some kind of reconciliation going on here uh, maybe this is somebody you knew from the past for some um, a lover or some type of connection uh, reminiscing about the past a very sweet love okay let me see what your romance angels messages are here okay love yourself first i feel like that's what you've got going on here right now <laughs> Aquarius you are loving you you're doing what's best for yourself your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive and here's children again definitely a reconciliation situation here maybe this person has children you have children they could be young they could be adults um, you might know this person or maybe you knew each other when you were children Yep, getting to know each other as you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. So it feels to me like you are, you've just been biding your time. You've got someone that really, that, that like two people who fall in love, two people who want to be together. And there's an energy of like the universe supporting this decision that might be, it's a challenge for you to have some kind of reunion with someone currently but i feel like you are heading in that direction by the end of this month and there is some type of like getting together a reconciliation but I, it's two people falling in love someone you know definitely feeling the same way as you do okay let me see what other messages there are here for you sometimes i stay awake thinking about you so you've got someone here who's like whew, preoccupied with your thoughts of you Aquarius okay yeah someone feels remorse for the way they treated you maybe that's a person that you're pulling away from um, they have regret oh my god that's the third time children is coming up here in your reading what is this children are very important to this partnership very very important whether it's your children or there's children involved on either side both sides or it's just 
fell in love when you were young and <laughs> coming back together oh my goodness okay yeah there's somebody that had to let you go or you had to let them go a long time ago and that was very hard they never forgot you Aquarius this person has never forgotten you beautiful message beautiful okay so um stay tuned you guys i know i said in august but i'm probably going to start doing those daily collective love readings when i finish all of the zodiac signs for the end of july so i might start that soon so keep your eyes peeled and uh yeah love you guys i'll see you later bye